Greetings everyone, Akuma Stu here from the Slongi and Stu YouTube channel and with me I have... Not Slongi. We have Not Slongi today and we're bringing you one of our favourite co-op campaign games that we've played so far which is called... For Honor. And we've played through it once or twice and we've went back to it a number of times and uh, we've really enjoyed it. So we're going to do a quick playthrough for you guys and... Uh, I guess we'll take it take it from there. And don't worry, it's really me, Slonky, but hey, Pro Honor is an awesome game. This is probably the first or second game that we finished from beginning to end. So it it was a lot of fun for us for sure. That's right, Sue. That's right. Very well said. Today we are in World One One. Warlords and Cowards. Yeah, I found this bit a little bit alarming Keep as the grown-up, that there was a... Uh, I thought this might be too gruesome, but in the end it, it really wasn't all that bad, even for young kids. How do you guys do? Like, I'm not that old, and I am playing this. Awesome, right? Say, Stu? No, I'm just letting the, the, view, the viewers um, see the cutscene. Which is over. Okay. Ready to defend the East Wall. The Haven't used a bow in a while. Ah! And now we've got to remember uh, some of the button mashing. Okay. So hold left trigger. That's how you lock onto the enemies. And quickly release and switch. So you use left trigger to switch. That's what I'm doing there. And then left trigger and right stick to change your guard. And Slongi has to do that to continue. Here we go. And then left trigger, right stick up, blocks. Here we go. Oops, I missed that one. Me too. There we go. Okay, so now you follow that where it, it glows red. And, uh, you'll be able to lock. I was watching the Slongi screen there, and uh, that was really a mistake on my part. So a light attack, it's left trigger, right bumper, and a heavy attack, left trigger, right trigger. Now we just kill them. We'll switch to Slongi screen just now to to uh, let you guys see a little bit more of what he's doing. So you can see the direction that he is blocking based on the white um, symbol. And mm -hmm. uh, that's right. So now you want to go defend the east wall. So we'll switch back to Stu's screen for the moment. And remember, you can always see Slongi's screen up on the right-hand side. Or you can just look at me running in front of Stu. Loot. I mean, Stu just sliced me. <laughs> Enemies in this territory, Daddy. Oops. Don't worry, Stu. It's okay. <laughs> that was easy. Yep. Now you can uh, help each other really well in this game by blocking. And then you can do different combinations for attack. 
And the green bar is your stamina bar. Uh, and that will tell you how much you can block and uh, how hard you can hit, or how many hits you can do. So you see I'm following Slongy down these stairs. And uh, Slongy is doing a serpentine there, it looked like. Maybe he had uh, too many beers uh, for lunch. And then this part here, you want to use right bumper, right trigger to attack as many of these guys as we can. And this game is all about the button smashing. It is so much fun. You don't have to be real good at it, and you can get all the way through. I'm using spin attacks. Oh no. I mean, oh yes. But who would be saying if I spun in space or into the ground? Okay, so I believe we would go up some um, ladders now. And we use Operation Human Shield send in the Slongies. Calling all Slongies. Am I seriously the only one here? No, behind us there was a captain to kill. There is. I think that's who I'm fighting. Stamina's pretty low here, Stu. Oh, and if you notice, your screen turns grey when you run out of stamina. Awesome, good job Slunky helping me out there. You're welcome, Stu. Come on, let's go. This is really the, one, of, uh, one of the worst doorways to get through <laughs> together. It's one thing in this game, it's uh, more realistic than other games, uh, but uh, we feel like we're uh, bouncing off each other a lot and doing more damage to each other than bad guys. Oh, I found some steel. That did not sound good. Reach those archers. Still ready to fire. And the cutscenes in this game are awesome. Definitely worth watching. I know, so let's not interrupt any more cutscenes. So my guy is so strong, you can knock a catapult off there like there's nothing. How we get down? Easy. Jump off. So right bumper, right attack, attack to drop, to do a drop attack. Oh yeah, who doesn't like those drop attacks? Ranking up those combos. Oh, I think that Afternoon is going to end this battle. That's right. Or is it raw? Just gonna have to find out. Who is this? I don't think that's a polygon. <laughs> Dominate! Dominate! Show yourself! These warriors don't have to die. Trial by combat. Right now. What? Fight you? That's we about to get challenged to a that's fight? Stu? 
Sorry, Slong, I didn't hear what you said. Are we about to get challenged to a fight, Stu? Oh, I think we are. You. Me? You will be my me? Second. He obviously said me. I think he said me. Eh, right, uh, no, he definitely said Slongy. <laughs> Cause Slongy <laughs> sounds more like me than Stu. I think we've got this. Maybe. Looks like we're both gonna fight him. Yes, we do. I'm spectating you right now, Stu. Go, Stu! I remember this from the, from the campaign. I remember this. Yeah, this didn't work well for you. Yeah, but I'm better now. Yeah, this is your very first time playing. Take a few tries. Hey, that's what's supposed to happen, right? Come on, Stu. Trash him. Bun smash and just spam it, Stu. My screen and Stu's screen He's are... Good. Well... I guess they're just exactly the same, except my screen's not great like Stu's, and you get a different view of Stu on mine. I needed to win, but not for Dominic. Time to spin around Stu and this guy. So I found the right bumper, right bumper, right trigger combo worked very good. Thank you for taking my advice, Stu. Uh, got him. And we're gonna use X to execute. Oh yeah, yeah, that, that got him. I didn't even get a chance to fight. Oh, you fight him now. I believe you have to fight him next. We Actually, no. I don't think so. Okay. Actually, maybe yes. Nope, I don't. I don't think. Well, we'll find out in a minute. It will not do for a knight of the Blackstone Legion well, if this person says yes, then we are probably going to switch to my screen, right? Don't slice that guy. Neil. Remember you thought he was gonna chop off her head just now? Oh yeah. <laughs> that wouldn't be a very nice way to to uh, win the battle. battle. For honor and service, I Holden Cross raise you. Stand, Knight of the Blackstone Legion. And that's how Akimastu became a knight. Yeah, go venture off in the night and never come back. We're finished here. Right, Stu? That's what happens when you're a knight at night. That's right. At night. Come at on. night. Midnight. In twilight. That <laughs> was how I joined the Black Stone. So many times I rhyme with night. Okay, guys, that is the end of that uh, quest line. Uh, so we're going to wrap up this video here. We'll be back in a second. Bye.